This is Darius from therabbitpad.com, and in this video, I'm going to show you how you can add columns in Google Sheets. Please make sure you click that subscribe button and that notification bell so that you can be notified when I publish videos in the future. In Google Sheets, if you want to add more rows to your spreadsheet, what you do is you go all the way to the bottom of the spreadsheet, which stops at 1000, and then you can put an exact number of rows that you would like to add in this box. So if I wanted to add five extra rows, I put a five there and then click add. And now those extra five rows have been added. However, when it comes to adding columns to the end of the document, you have to follow a slightly different process. In Google Sheets, the columns by default stop at Z. So if you want to add extra columns, this is what you do. You highlight the last column, which is Z and then you select insert, click on columns, and then click insert one column to the right, which will now start a new column called AA. You can also right click and select insert one column, but with right clicking, you can only insert columns on the left. So it will put this column to the left of the column that you are clicking. So let's say I write the word cat in this cell. If I right click that and then click insert one column left, now the cell with cat inside of it has been shifted to AB with the new column being a new AA cell. So this is how you insert columns at the end of a Google Sheet. If you found this video helpful, please click that like button and subscribe to this channel for more helpful tips. Also, please be sure to visit my website at therabbitpad.com.